Well, I picked up the paper the other day and I saw a picture of Royals manager Ned Yost looking very relaxed in a full back chair watching his team in a game at spring training. I thought, oh boy, what a life. Baseball managers have the best job in Major League Sports. They might have the best job in America. Think about it. You escape the harsh winters by leaving early for spring training in Arizona and Florida. You have all summer getting paid big bucks to watch big league baseball every day. You basically get to sit on your can all day long watching your coaches do the grunt work. You even have a bench coach to sit next to you on game days. He gives you a nudge just in case you doze off in that hot afternoon sun. There is one drawback. It's pretty much seven days a week on the job all summer long, but come on now. How much strain and pressure is there filling out a lineup card every day? The worst part of this job is talking to the media on a daily basis. Whitey Herzog put it best many years ago when he said managers are hired to be fired. And I have to believe being a manager of the Kansas City Royals is the safest job in all of sports. This team has been so bad for so long, only a miracle is expected when you're hired. After all, you get to work with the most unpopular owner in all of baseball. Fans pretty much leave you alone in this town. They vent their anger and venom at David Glass. He's the bad guy in KC. History shows a Royals manager can lose 100 games every season, still keep his job for at least three years. That's why I love my job as a trained skeptic. It's amazing what you can do with a microphone. You nearly always get the last word. That's Jack Smack.